Hi, I'm Scott James and I'm the captain of the Knights of Albion and today I'll be doing a review of my new helmet by armourer Pablo Kozak. So this style of helmet is called a cross bassinet, um, sometimes called a ghost face bassinet. It's got really good breathing and visibility but it's also a bassinet so it can take quite a big hit. Um, the reason I went with this style was because as I've gotten more experienced in the sport, I found breathing and visibility have become quite important to me, especially in duels. And my last time it was a Spiletto or a Griffin, and it was quite heavy and tanky, which is, has its benefits, but I'll leave that for another video. The armorer was Pablo. He was very easy to talk to, um, speaks good English. Um, he responds to your messenger almost immediately. He charged me $650 US, um, which is quite standard for a uh, Boohut rated helm. Um, and it, um, he, I paid on PayPal and it was quite easy. So when it comes to appearances, um, it has a nice finish. Uh, the male is, uh, looks really good. Ukrainian male generally is. Um, what occurred to me initially when I picked it up was it's quite light. Um, it's a three millimeter dome, which is actually polished and ground down to close to two and a half millimeters, which is more than enough for the sport. Um, yeah, and it comes with the side and back plates and a Simon strap at standard. Um, yeah, and also another interesting design feature is it's quite long, longer than most bassinets, but what they've done is they've brought the cage out so that your face isn't anywhere near when, you, when there's uh, a risk of contact. So it's actually a very cool design feature. On the inside of the helmet, instead of there being the basic two strap system, what they've done is they've got one strap, kind of like a military donut strap, and they've got another strap, which when you pull on it, it actually pulls that strap closer. So that's really, really useful for when you're fighting. So when you pull on that strap, it makes your chin nice and tight, and then you can actually buckle that strap lower down so that it's just easy to put on. So I thought that was a really, really ingenious design. Um, the padding is fantastic, it's quite thick. And um, yeah, so I tested this yesterday. I did some duels and some boohurts. Um, took a few big hits, didn't feel anything. It was Breathing was fantastic, nice and light. Um, yeah, uh, some of the two-handed hits left some little dents, which is fine. Um, that's what they're meant to do, a good, a good tempered helmet that is designed to work like that. And um, yeah, I just think it's a fantastic helmet. So um, I'm definitely gonna recommend this style of helmet to my teammates, and I would definitely get another helmet from Pavlo. So yeah, thanks for that, cheers.